It's it's always cool to see like a potential upset brewing. Yeah, uh, yeah. People start cheering and stuff like that. Um, I, you're absolutely right. Uh, Dreamland for game one. Um, Good pressure. Good trade going on to start. Yes. So, for Joey, what is like the big thing? Do you think in this matchup against like Falco Fox? Obviously, they absolutely mangle each other. Um, at whenever they are able to get a touch. But uh, um, what I think about this matchup from the, from the Falcons perspective is that you're going to see the Fox full hopping a lot. Okay. And it's how the Falco deals with that. Yes. Like whether you can up till a, an early aerial or if he comes with a late aerial, then you got to CC if you're a lower percent. Mm -hmm. Maybe get out of the way for the grab. That makes sense. Oh, it says that DBZ. Yeah, there's a lot of trades going on in this yeah. first stock. All right, that was a great back air by Joey. Oh, um, Tony's double jump. Joey at the ledge. We're gonna get a combo started and he denies it. Extra opportunity and he gets it. Back to the neutral. Do the full hops hurt. Even from the jump yep. from platform, like Anthony just did there, is really good against Falco. Yes. Like for Fox, you're gonna be on top of Falco. Yeah, uh, if Fal yeah, I I agree with that. As because if Fal goes above you, you know, just fundamentally, that yeah. dare is a big move and a good move. The higher um, priority is getting faster than any move you have on the ground. Yep. You just gotta find a way to outspace it or outbeat it. Gear force. That's a good tag. There we go. That was a good conversion by Joey. Double whisper from Ooh, I haven't seen. Joey must not be like. Oh well, now uh, now as I say it, like he's starting to throw a couple lasers, but uh, I feel like he might just have a rhythm on Anthony to where like Anthony might just disrupt his rhythm with lasers because I really don't see very many lasers. Um, I mean, yeah, he's definitely not shooting as many lasers as mm -hmm. he normally does. I think. Okay. Yeah. But that could um, also be, Anthony's playing a bit more aggressive this game, so he's mm -hmm. like putting Joey in the corner more often. Yes. I, and I think that absolutely makes sense. Yeah. Uh, if Joey's just kind of reading, reading the rhythm of Anthony, uh, then uh, that absolutely makes sense. Uh, but that's also well done by Anthony to negate uh, one of Joey's uh, best tools in laser. For sure. Shine out a shield. Yeah, much off of the zone. All these full ops that Ooh. Anthony's doing on Joey's shield. Yeah. Avoiding the shield pressure. Mm -hmm. Yeah, the full hop Nair is uh, doing word of wonders. Um, Neither of them have really gotten that big of a punisher scan. No. Uh, oh, that's an unfortunate uh, air dodge. No, it's actually just been them uh, getting like little neutral engagements, like little 20, 30 percent, uh, like chains, and then not much. Um, I'm interested to see if there's going to be any uh, like long combo things. Because uh, we started a lot of DI mess up start going yeah. on. Yeah. Well. Yes. And he's like switching that, up his hold away, his hold in. That full hop there was great. Uh, and it is, yeah, it's definitely really catching Joey. Oh, wow. What a great nice forward smash. Back. Yeah. Had the right input, just missed mm -hmm. on the R there. And we got the synchronized water drink. <laughs> Not so synchronized, but. Really well played game by Joey. Yes. Was it too much comboing there, but they both played pretty aggressive. Mm -hmm. For sure. Is Anthony very good at, like, chain grabbing Falcos? Uh, uh, he should be. Yeah, I would think so. Uh, so he'll probably end up going FD here. Then I um, would think. Maybe. Oh, he's with it going to Yoshi. Oh, okay. Anthony's, Anthony and Dez, Lexor, mm -hmm. you know, they've had a lot of talk that they think that Falco might end up winning on FD because of the punish game. That absolutely makes sense, yeah. Because yeah. uh, if you get a shine, yeah, uh, you just get pillar comboed. Um, Not even that. If you get like a downer from Falco, oh, Falco just bring you to like 50 or 60 
it's guaranteed. And then after that, he can get put off stage or you get into a tech position. It's tough for one hit. In, that's, that makes absolute sense. Well, so. Fox has to look for more of like getting that grab opening or mm -hmm. a nair that could lead to a grab. That makes sense. Yeah, and Fo Fox isn't marked. Like, so, like, getting a grab, you can get grabs, but it, it is more difficult. Yeah, he does not have the range that a yeah. Marth would. Um. Ooh. There we go. Great back air. Up back beside me. Mm -hmm. So I'm kind of interested what uh, Anthony's kind of keys to winning. Uh, and, and is this best of five uh, for all of like, top uh, 32, I think? I think it might be. Um, I, well, we'll ask Theo in a sec, but, uh, oh, great forward so, smash. Looks at the stream setup, it looks like it's still best of three. Yeah. Um, I'm not sure. That was a great up air. It, it seems like the dynamic of this game, and I, I think it's a pretty correct, that was a great shine spike by Anthony, and, like, more of those. I was saying, um, like, he has been pinning Joey in the corner quite a bit. Um, yeah. So, like, more of those conversions, it's surprising that he's not able to get those shine spikes like that and stuff like that where when you're kind of stuck in the corner. And you're gonna, like, that four full hop up air is a really good way to catch Falco off guard. Mm -hmm. So, like, at a nair at that percent, you're not getting too much off of that if the Falco holds away. But if you do an up air, you can maybe get a tech chase on the top platform or the side flat. Yeah. That makes sense. A really good play from Anthony there. Yeah. Oh. Ooh, here we go. Quick zero to forty from Joey. There's a ledge. Ooh, okay. Ooh, look for the platform. There. Oh, oh Joey there. was reading something, but it was not Anthony. I think they covered every option besides Tekken. Oh, you, yeah. yeah. That that's actually true. Text to place, text to right. Mm -hmm. Ooh, wall jump. Double wall jump. Ooh, good back good, play by good catch. Yeah. Was able to reset. I guess a jab reset with the laser. A really good play. Ooh, another quick zero to forty from Joey. It it honestly feels like Joey is because he. He is kind of being in the corner uh, with Anthony, but like he's able to just his punish game has been a lot stronger. Yeah, I feel like fundamentally than Anthony, especially the lower percents. Joey mm -hmm. just every time Anthony's at zero, he gets oh, a, he gets that's a unfortunate. Hit. Oh, so this this is a best of five. Let's cap the event in five minutes. That'd be pretty dope. March 19th. March 19th. Bet. Mark your calendars, everyone. Uh, <laughs> this is a great event. A lot of fun. Uh, great food, great drinks, great people. It's a lot bigger than I thought it would be. Yeah, no. Sure. This like I everyone who I have talked to has been like, this venue is sweet. Um, yeah. Like from the looks of it, from this camera angle, I think it looks a bit cramped and yeah. light. Well, there's like another entire room on the top deck. Yes. That's just full of melee setups as well. Or mm -hmm. I guess that's, that's where the PM setups are. Uh, there is a melee setup up there, yeah. but yeah. <laughs> it's been basically... Uh, there's like plenty of places to sit. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no. Uh, there's, like there's like three couches over there. Mm -hmm. What's, What's up? up? Uh, all right, game two. Okay, they're going back to Yoshi's. Anthony probably just likes to corner Joey. This this stage probably makes it a lot easier for Anthony to put Joey in the corner. Yeah, I and gives Joey less room for him to run. Cause I I, I think a Anthony has honestly played his game plan out pretty well in just keeping Joey pretty cornered. It's just it comes down to the punish game. That's an a really unfortunate yeah. down smash to get smacked by. Like off of that nair, Joey just shielded right after and Anthony went for some shine presser. He mm -hmm. could have just grabbed off of that and gotten another punish. Like small things like that. Yeah. 
It really changed the game. I think Joey might be kind of figuring out. Ooh, that was great. Um, but Joey, like the, the full hop nares, Joey might have been a little bit on the cadence of that. Uh, like kind of understood when Anthony's coming in. And it seems like Anthony's kind of mixing it up. Uh, he's getting some more, and his punish game is kind of turned on. That was sweet. Like, is that a zero to death? For me? Yeah. That was awesome. The best punish he's had. Though. Yeah. Mm -hmm. oh. oh, shoot. Like, comes back with it. But I mean, e no matter what, even if Joey just kind of like beat him up there, if, if Anthony's punish game turns on like it did that last stock, like, I, we I gotta. Think, this set's not over. Yeah, I think Anthony needs to just go for a few more grabs. I agree. Um, it seems like, like he got that entire punish off of just one grab that he just converted into a zero to death. Yeah. And it looks like he's not going for many grabs at all until he's in the shield. He's just going for the shield pressure. Hoping to get something like that. Yeah. And it's interesting that you uh, uh, said, like, how him and Lexar have talked about, like, how FD might not still be good. But, like, up throwing spaces is still really, yeah. really solid. For so, on any stage. You yeah. Have platform attack chase. Which is maybe another grab into an up air. You hit so much off of a grab. Absolutely. Oh, uh, Randall was almost there yeah. first. I'm not seeing Anthony go for too many of them. So he's getting shines. Oh. 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 Spot dodges? Ooh. I wonder why Joey's going to uh, or opting for the down throw. I, I think it's bot. just a mix up. Wow. That's it. Dang. That was, well played that was by pretty Joey. dominant by Joey, yeah.